Aloha, I am Major Amanda Pelkowski and this is your Bellows Update. Hi, I'm Master Sergeant Rachel Tate, the Senior Enlisted Leader here at Bellows and I'm here to give you the upcoming events for September. On Saturday, September 17th from 3 to 5 p.m. will be Wood Wall Art Class. Create your own painted wood wall art. $65 per person, ages 18 or older. Please contact Turtle Cove at 808-259-4135. On Saturday, 24 September, we will have a movie under the stars. It's gonna be a double feature, Top Gun and Top Gun Maverick. Free admission and entertainment from US Pacific Fleet Band. Drink specials and food available for purchase along with raffle prizes. For those who don't know, Bellows Air Force Station was shut down from the 1st to the 28th of August for a World War II munitions removal project. Initial investigations found UXOs and they are properly and safely disposed of. As a result, it has been determined that there is need for further surveys in certain areas. Until further notice, the following safety precautions are immediately implemented within the exclusion zone. The Menehune campgrounds are closed. There is no soil disturbing activities to include, but not limited to, digging tent stakes and umbrellas only in the exclusion zone. And do not enter the wooded area. Failure to comply with installation policies will result in eviction without refund. We take the safety of service members, civilians, and their families in our communities very seriously and continue to examine ways to make our installations and facilities safer. I've been asked several times why did it take so long for Bellows to get cleaned up. It's 2022 and these munitions are from World War II and earlier. A little history for you. Bellows Air Force Station became a recreation area in 1958 once our active runway was closed. Before then, we had lots of aircraft here and we had several bombing practice targets. Back in World War II and prior, there were not the same regulations for cleanup as there are now. The Department of Defense initially introduced the MMRP, i.e. Military Munitions Response Program in 2001 to address the remediation of UXOs and discarded military munitions. They started investigating at Bellows in 2006 and that started the process. As you can tell, it is now 2022 and it takes a while. There's a very long, arduous process that goes along with it that I will save you the details here. Just know that it ties to funding. So all of this, our shutdown and everything, was accumulation of probably a decade of work right now so that they can investigate what exactly was left behind and what needs to be cleaned up. I've been asked several times, is Bello safe? We'll keep it short and simple. If Bellows was unsafe for you to be at, we would not be open. That's all we have for you this month. Thank you for your questions. Thank you for your feedback. Please keep it coming. We love hearing from you. And most of all, thank you for choosing Bellows. Aloha.